Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9. Our morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock. Starting now with news that the oil price fell to $117 a barrel overnight. There was a slowdown in demand in the US and US inventories of crude oil rose quite significantly. And what does this all mean? Well, the New Zealand dollar fell to a fresh 10-month low of 71.6 US cents. A couple of reasons there. We've got a stronger US dollar. Seems to be a close relationship between the, the oil price and the US dollar. When the oil price goes down, the US dollar goes up. When the US dollar goes up, the New Zealand dollar versus the US dollar obviously goes down. And there's a couple of reasons for that stronger US dollar, the oil price, but also the US markets rallied overnight. Uh, Cisco, the technology company, reported strong sales, and Microsoft apparently is thinking of buying back $20 billion worth of shares. So what does this all mean for the petrol price here? So we've got the crude price falling, but the New Zealand dollar falling as well, which means that the price of petrol will rise. Actually, it will go to $2.08 a litre at current prices versus about $2.03 a litre now. We just can't seem to get a break. The currency has now fallen 9.4% since May. And this now raises the question, can we still afford these rate cuts the Reserve Bank has been talking about? One of its caveats in its comments when it made its rate cut on July 24 is, as long as the currency doesn't fall too far, too fast. I'm Bernard Hickey, that was 90 seconds at 9 o'clock on interest.co.nz.